to ask an important question. If a corporation is a person, what sort of person is it? Legally, corporation is considered a person. In court, it is tried as a person. The Fourteenth Amendment, which was created in order to give freedom and rights to blacks, was primarily used over the next 30 years to gain more rights for corporations because, you know, lawyers are tricksy bastards. And they wanted to use it, of course, to the benefit of their corporations, their clients that were paying them well. And why can clients pay lawyers so well? Well, because their only objective is to make money. In fact, in general, the entire mentality is do as little as possible for the biggest result. That is capitalism in a nutshell. Let me turn this hour into as much money as it possible. Let me earn $10 an hour. Let me earn $20 an hour. Let me earn $50 an hour. Let me earn 25000 a year. Let me earn 100000 a year. You know what? How about a couple billion a year? That sounds nice, doesn't it? Um, wouldn't you rather be driving a Ferrari than a beat-up old Honda? Probably. So, greed just escalates. And corporations, they don't have the same morals as the rest of us, because no snowflake in an avalanche feels responsible. I mean, if you were that snowflake in that avalanche, why would you feel responsible? It's not your fault that all that other snow is falling down. I mean, why, why do you care? So, the corporation is just this one large avalanche. And you're probably thinking, corporations aren't really that destructive, are they? I mean, they bring you things that you want, things that you need, things that you asked for. Or maybe they're bringing you things that they tell you that you need and that you asked for. Therefore, you buy their products, because, you know, that's what they need you to do as a consumer. If you don't buy their products, then, well, they'll go out of business. What corporations would you put out of business if you could? Why don't you just stop buying from those corporations? But let's get back to that important question. What kind of person is this legal person called a corporation? Well, they're kind of immoral, because they don't really give a damn about the rest of us, what happens to the environment or to their workers or, well, to anybody. The only thing that matters is that they get paid, and they get paid fast. And there's a reason for this, because whoever's backing them, you know, the people who have stocks in them, want money because they invested in them. So they have to be able to, you know, give those stockers a good payout. So, we know they're immoral. We know they're greedy. Uh, we know that they don't like to take the blame. We know they're kind of manipulative, you know, with product placement and advertisements and they kind of trick us into believing that we need and want their products. Hmm. We know they're kind of irresponsible. I mean, they don't really care, generally, if they dump thousands of millions of pounds of junk into the water supply, or, you know, if they put chemicals in the animals that harm us, that, you know, that harm the animals and us, because the animals are harmed by the chemicals, and then we eat the animals, and then we're harmed by those chemicals. And let's see, what else do they do? They dump thousands of pounds of chemicals upon crops that we then eat, because, you know, they got to kill those bugs off real fast and easily, as cheaply as possible. Not the most healthy way to do it. Yeah, kind of short-term thinking. I mean, if they wanted to do the best they wanted to do quality over quantity, that they would want things to last, but really they want quantity, because quantity means greater profit right now, and that's what the stockers want. So, let's match this up with the characteristics of a psychopath. A psychopath's characteristics 
superficially charming, self-centered and self-important, deceptive behavior and lying, conning, manipulative, little or no remorse, no feeling of guilt, callous, lack of empathy, living off of others with a predatory attitude, lacking in realistic long-term goals or short-sightedness, irresponsible, blaming others for their actions, short-term relationships, criminal activity. Are corporations criminals? Look it up.